younger than the youngest of America's Costa Rican opponents. And it is the US in the predominantly red and the blue who get us underway rather than handle it. And here comes Matarita for Costa Rica. And arriving is Fuller, is scored! Exactly one minute in, Keisha Fuller. Well, and there was a big question mark for Costa Rica, whether or not they would sit and play with five in the back and absorb the pressure from the United States. And yet, that's the exact opposite of by which they've, they've come out and absolutely punched the United States right in the mouth. Now, the question mark here is the Costa Rican attacking player in the line of sight of Zach Steffen, and he's not because out of your picture, Serginho Dest is on the end line from where the ball originally came from. So that player right there is not in an offside position. Good no call from the assistant referee. So we're at the second in the qualifying table, five games in. Here's where for waiting. Dest though was very tightly marked as soon as he received the ball. He Look at the good understanding. Instead of overlapping because Wea has got the outside, Des comes inside and allows that 1v1 moment for Timothy Wea to get in behind. Costa Rica have had a chance to regroup, but here's Des. Oh! -ho! Just like his first goal for the US. Back against Jamaica earlier in the year. It's another thunderbolt from Serginio Des. It's been nine games since the United States have scored in the first half, and they needed to give up an early goal to wake up, to be aggressive. How's this from the 20-year-old of Barcelona? What a fantastic strike to cut inside on his left foot and take the defender on and then have the quality to put it past a world-class goalkeeper and Keylor Navas. Through all the struggles of World Cup qualifying, one thing's been apparent from this young side under Greg Berhalter. They react, they don't mind adversity, and they've answered the bell in the 26th minute. Slick from Costa Rica, and a chance for Costa Rica. Moya, tackle came in from Richards. It was clean enough. Costa Rica player down on the floor. Zach Steffen was decisive too. Referee says play on. A chance which is helped on its way. And Tyler Adams is livid right now with Timothy Way and Brendan Aronson because over the last three minutes, the United States have been slapping their defensive third playing on. I go back to that point of keeping your foot down on the on the pedal. Away we go then. What about his younger brother, Paxton. Oh, mistake. And this is Brian Ruiz, and he may need help because he lacks pace. He was never quick, but these days he's very slow. Because this is almost identical to the World Cup qualifying goal at Red Bull Arena in 2017, where they were spread out at Marco Arena, out of the blue, caught him off guard, and put it in the back of the net. Fortunate for the U.S. and Miles Robinson, then that was 36-year-old Brian Ruiz, who's on his last leg of his career. It's mostly defensive on that part. Here's where! It's in. Timothy Weir celebrates. It may go down as an own goal because it came off the post onto the keeper and in. Puts the United States on its heels. And then this one can't deal with the ugly ball from Weston McKinney. And very quickly, Serginho Des recognizes exactly the opportunity ahead of him. Take one touch, play way ahead of him. And great on Timothy Weir to not take a touch. If he takes a touch, his angle's gone. But he turns his body, has a hit near post. For the luck of the United States here in Columbus, it's 2-1 with a huge goal from Timothy Weah. Well, technically, in most places around the world, that is an own goal. McKinney. Anthony Robinson. Oh, it was nearly a second own goal. That would have been Calvo was nearly own goal number two. Well, it's been the destined Anthony Robinson show tonight. Bolaños.
Austin was in there. Sabaria was in there as well. And in the end, it's a free kick. It's Kendall Wasted against Gianluca Busio. And so the referee, allowing Zimmerman and Zardes to come in here, allowed the United States a better opportunity to defend this in front of Zach Steffen. Halfway to Cincinnati. It's next stop Cincinnati. And the United States have got themselves back on track.